بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم Dear brothers and sisters, peace be upon you all. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. We meet again to talk about the great Imam al-Bukhari. Today we would like to shed some light on his character, his traits, his personality. And with this I mean here, was he generous? Was he humble? What do we have? What information do we have? We have a lot of information that would strike to discover that he was really a great man, to the extent that probably he was a perfect example of the Prophet wasallam. A proof of this is we see that uh, his scribe, one of his main students, authored the book and named the book as Shama'il of Al-Bukhari, taking the word Shama'il from the Prophet wasallam, denoting it to him. He was humble, he was generous, forgiving. Once uh, his servant did something wrong, he did not only pardon her, he set her free, just acting upon a verse of the Quran. Those who suppress their anger, forgive people, pardon people, and present an act of charity, do extra. And he did this extra. He helped building once uh, a ribat outside Bukhara, and he was carrying bricks himself. Was, although he was famous and he was a great imam, he didn't mind doing it himself. In person, he was so ascetic. For 40 years, he used to eat only bread, nothing extra. When he fell ill, doctors said he had to eat something with bread. He started eating a bit of sugar with bread. And uh, he had some wealth. His father left for him some wealth, and uh, he invested. Uh, he had some land also. The revenue of the land he used to spend on his journeys, on his uh, studies. And uh, Later on, uh, he also did some business with others who run the business for him, and all the income he would spend on his students. To the extent he purchased a home for one of his students, he wanted to divide his wealth in halves, one half for him and one half for his scribe. These are beautiful examples. He was always a man of silence. He did not speak much. Uh, he said in one of his statements, he never backbit any person the moment he learned when he was a young boy that uh, backbiting is forbidden in Islam. His uh, asceticism uh, probably resulted in him being very lean. So he wasn't tall, he wasn't short, he was a very lean person. This is in his constitution. Uh, but as a character, Al-Bukhari was a great man who presented the best example of the character of the Prophet <laughs> Uh, I'm